Hey, I'm Jess. And I'm Doug. Thanks for coming to the 920 special. This was week two of level one, eight count. So this week, we worked on some fun new things. Um, the first was the promenade, yeah. which uh, looks like this. It has a leader in front and a follower in front. We'll show you both. Leader in front. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. uh, and then follower in front. And we talked about using those triple steps to really get to where we need to be. So for the leader in front, the leader's going to get right in front of me. We're going to be pretty much square before we start moving back or as we start moving back. And then using my triple step to really come around to the side so that we get back into closed. And same thing for the followers. In front, back, back, and then the leaders come to the side. Yeah. Um, we also talked about how this coming in front is not the same as the yo-yo that we did last week. Right, which we reviewed. So when we do the yo-yo, if the leader goes in front, we end up, I end up staying in place because my leader's not asking me to move forward. So I'm going to do my triple step pretty much right in place, and then my leader's going to come back. So with the promenade, we're going to use that triple step to start moving forward so that it's very clear to your partner that you want them to travel. Um, um, and it might not look that way, but on the follower in front, that's still true. Um, I'm not asking just to move very far that way when we do the follower in front. I'm just bringing her in front and having her triple set mostly in place. Um, but then when we do the promenade... Doug really starts booking forward. So I feel that, I notice it. But he, at the same time, he lets me set the pace. He's not going to run me over. Uh, so, you know. And at the same time, I'm not going to... Sorry. <laughs> I'm not going to like book it away from him and be like, see you later. Because, you know, it's a partner dance. So. That's a different move. Try it out. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> so, um, what was... Yeah, so we spent a long time on uh, promenade just really figuring out the subtleties of that and practicing leading and following those differences. Um, and how that is different from the yo-yo stuff and also the circle, which we did last week. Um, and then we moved on to uh, swing out from closed, which looks like this. So we brought this front hand into play. Uh, and we showed you the cup. Followers, put your hand right in the cup. And... And leaders, we talked about not putting your hand yes. on uh, your partner's on top of your partner's hand, because even if you're uh, not initially squeezing, it's very easy to tense up and end up squeezing on your partner's hand. So keeping it over to the side is just safer and nicer. We also talked about keeping this connection nice and relaxed. We don't want this. We don't want this. <laughs> just nice and relaxed. So your hands are, very, are connected, but there's a nice little gentle swing there. Yeah. Um, um, and then we talked about how this uh, coming in front uh, one through one, two, three, four for a swing out is like the leader in front promenade. I'm giving just this feeling of coming forward. Right, which makes me want to start moving. Yeah. Um, and then it's just uh, stepping backwards and rotating as a leader. Mm -hmm. And then for followers. For followers, uh, I'm sorry. I'm using. <laughs> For followers, uh, let's start from closed, though. Oh, sorry. right. Uh, yeah. Closed over here. <laughs> followers. So as Doug turns his body, that makes me turn my body too. So I'm starting to rotate, and then I'm going out backwards for my triple step. Right. Yeah. So we're sort of slowly moving away from each other a little bit here. So it's uh, it'll feel a little bit like the circle, except that you're getting that linear. Um, Right. feeling uh, before momentum you, right yeah um so we're going to talk more about the swing out from close next week yes uh and uh, and we'll do uh circle stuff and we're just going to keep building on the stuff that we have you guys are looking great in your basics and your yeah. promenades and your yo-yos um keep practicing your basic 
uh, just that rock step, triple step, rock step, triple step. And you can do it with the step steps that we did in the promenade. Um, you can do it any which way up. you want. You can do it in circles. You yeah. can do it in lines. <clears throat> Whatever you want. Just get um, it in your body. The more you practice that footwork, the easier it will be to learn these moves continuing yeah. on. So good job. See you guys next week. Bow, bow.